transform your hair with hair growth products by 12 tribes on earth. Experience natural, powerful ingredients that promote thicker, longer, and healthier hair. Say goodbye to thinning and hello to confidence. Hair growth oil, shampoo, spray, and butter by 12 tribes on earth because your hair deserves the best. Just look for the links in the comment section. You know, a few weeks ago, Shannon Sharp had Gary Owens on Club Shay Shay. And Gary made a comment about how, you know, Shannon don't protect black women. And Shannon laughed. So now he is getting dragged for praising Caitlin Clark. And he had some harsh comments about Shakari Richardson. And it rubbed a lot of people the wrong way. Mm, mm, mm. So let's get into it. Support for Caitlin Clark, but harsh. Shakari Richardson treatment land Shannon Sharp in trouble for resurface comment. Shakari Richardson and Caitlin Clark, two of the most discussed American sports stars, hail from different sports backgrounds and many other aspects. Yet, the fate has dealt them a similar bitter blow at various times, causing them to miss their first Olympic births at critical times in their career. Shakari Richardson missed the 2021 Olympics due to a failed drug test. Meanwhile, the Paris Olympic bound USA basketball squad recently sidelined Caitlin Clark I don't really think that's accurate. Caitlin was never chosen for the team. So how could they sideline her? I think that's kind of ridiculous, but let me go on. Things have changed drastically since then. Communities have started to compare the two sportswomen. However, Shannon Sharp has created a controversy in a debate, the fame Sports commentator has expressed differing opinions on Shakari Richardson and Caitlin Clark missing their Olympic opportunities. According to fans, his criticism of Richardson is unwarranted. So Sharp doesn't want a fight with Caitlin Clark's fame. Recently, the NAACP president, Bishop, Talbert, Swan pointed out a post on X. He said that after the news broke about Caitlin Clark's absence from the American women's basketball squad for Paris, Sharp sided with the rookie, smashing the USA Basketball Authority's decision. Sharp supported Caitlin by Penning, this is what he said, name a more popular woman basketball player right now than Caitlin Clark. So that's what Shannon Sharp wrote. Mm, mm, mm. So he is like Stephen A joining, you know, the bandwagon for Caitlin. I'm not surprised. You know, you got Shannon Sharp. And remember, Shannon dated black, um, white women. So I'm not surprised. So, mm -mm -mm. but when it came to discussing Shikari Richardson missing the Olympics, Sharp had a fiery response criticizing the sprinter. He said she could have competed. She didn't qualify to compete. Stop the bull jive antic. Train hard. Sports aren't sympathetic. You do or you don't. Oh, really? Mm -mm -mm. 
Shakari Richardson had to face suspension for violating WADA rules by consuming banned substances. But several big names, such as Alexis Ohanan, argued that things could have been uh, traded carefully. And, you know, Shikari had some support back then, but you know how it is. She was a champion, so they were happy to get rid of her from the Olympics. And plus, she had lost her mother, you know, and I think around that same time. So she was dealing with grief the best that she could. Despite her grief, she competed in the 100 meters U.S. Olympic trial race and won. Unfortunately, this emotional story seemed to hold little value for Shannon Sharp, who favored the authorities' decision to select Caitlin Clark based on her popularity. Mm-mm-mm. So Shannon is having a not so good time. People are not happy with these positions that many of these sport commentators are taking when it comes down to Caitlin Clark. And look, y'all, these women are in different sports, but you can best believe Shakari Richardson is going to draw a lot of attention to track and field when the Olympics take place in Paris. They act like Caitlin is the only headline uh, for anything at this point. Oh, nobody's bigger than Caitlin. That's a damn lie. That's a lie. And people watch the Olympics for a variety of different reasons. And number two, women's basketball has never been the biggest thing in the Olympics anyway. There are gymnastics, there's track and field that have always outshined the basketball teams in the Olympics. I mean, that's a fact. That's a fact. I mean, it's up there and people do watch it because, you know, whatever country you represent, you're going to watch. But let's not act like there is nobody else that can draw attention. That's a lie. That's a lie. So recently, Stephen A. was dragged for his position on Caitlin Clark being in the Olympics. He was for her going to the Olympic team as a rookie with no international experience and people dragged him on that. So y'all, let me know how you feel about Shannon Sharp. He got loving words for Caitlin Clark, but harsh words for Shakari Richardson. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.